I'm Mark Wooters, Lead Urban Designer for the Saskatoon City Centre Plan. In developing this plan, we integrated economic revitalization strategies into the design of public spaces and walkable neighbourhoods. The wide streets of Saskatoon provided both the opportunity and room to insert important amenities. 23rd Street, which links City Hall Square to Saskatoon's riverfront, is a perfect example. Our search of precedents from all over the world took us to Park Avenue in Manhattan. Here churches, museums, and apartments are all connected by Central Green. As one of New York's showcases for art, Park Avenue is an integral part of the city's cultural identity. Using Park Avenue as a model, the plan transforms the lightly traveled way of 23rd Street into a greenway. With additional rows of trees and outdoor spaces for sculpture, 23rd Street becomes the civic spine of Saskatoon. It is an outdoor museum connecting the city's library, city hall, and riverfront park. Like Park Avenue, it will attract new residents. Another great example of retrofitting wide streets is New York's Meatpacking District. Here, large areas of empty asphalt were transformed by items as simple as potted plants, bollards, and tables and chairs. The transformation not only increased pedestrian visitation to retailers, but it attracted large numbers of new residents. The transformation of 21st Street includes a new linear park that brings many of these same elements to Saskatoon's retail pool. The new 21st Street will strengthen existing retail and attract new residents. The design also celebrates some of the city's most important historic landmarks. This vital public space can elevate Saskatoon's visibility across the nation, help build the downtown economy, and attract new residents.